Bessie's Flying Circus. Biff, Chip, Wilf, and Wilma went to an aircraft museum. They saw a plane with two wings. It's called a biplane, said Wilf. I bet it's cold when you fly, said Biff. I would like to fly a plane one day, said Wilma. The children were in Biff's bedroom. They were reading about the first ever air shows. Suddenly, the magic key began to glow. It took the children into an adventure. The children were at an air show. It was Bessie's flying circus. Six planes were flying together. I'd like to do that, said Wilma. Me too, said Chip and Wilf. I bet that's cold, said Biff. Bessie was the pilot of the plane in front. There were people standing on the wings. Look at the wing walkers, said Wilf. They must be brave. I'd like to do that, said Wilma. After the show had finished, the children saw Bessie. Let's talk to her, said Wilma. Wilma told Bessie that she wanted to learn to fly just like her. I'm sure you can, said Bessie. A woman went by with a heavy bag. Wilf asked if he could help. No, go away, the woman snapped. Why was she so nasty, said Wilf. I bet she's up to something. He crept after her. The woman took a can out of her bag. She put it by Bessie's plane and took the can that was there. Wilf ran to tell Bessie. A woman has changed over the petrol cans, he said. Why? I bet the other can is full of water, gasped Bessie. My plane won't fly with water in the tank. They ran back, but it was too late. Bessie's man had put the water in. I have an idea, said Bessie. This is a new kind of plane, said Bessie. No one has ever seen it before. She told the children to get in. You are my first passenger, she said. People looked surprised. Bessie's new plane took off. A huge banner flew behind the plane. It said, Bessie's passenger service. The children waved to the people. This is exciting, said Biff, and it's not cold. Why did a woman want to stop you flying? asked Wilf. She doesn't like me, said Bessie. But she won't stop me, she said. I won't let her win. The magic key began to glow. I'm going to fly a plane one day, said Wilma. We'll be your passengers, said Chip.